My name is James Steffes. I retired as an engine chief, E7, and we were up in the area when the whole 19 boat incident and the helicopters took place. And we found ourselves uh, facing down two lighted aircraft that would go on either side of us and turn off their lights and then start shooting at us. And after going through all of the, the, the routine of are they friendly, they're not friendly, are they, you know, uh, can we fire, we can't fire. And uh, finally when these two lined up and they fired a rocket at us and missed, and then they started in with the with the machine guns, my boat officer just went up there and essentially told Admiral Hoffman, <laughs> unless otherwise directed, they call that a unit air, unless otherwise directed, I'm taking these guys under fire. And they said, wait, 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 and he actually did the John, my radio, I can't, I can't, I'm not hearing you. <laughs> and that's what we did. That was the most scary. I was, I was new in there. Uh, my job was pumping ammo to keep these guys busy. And uh, that was probably the most scary. Some of them down in the Delta where we were in areas where we, we weren't allowed to shoot unless we got shirt first and there'd be, there'd be bunkers over there. And uh, so that was kind of creepy. And you have four or five boats in the canal and there's no place to go. You know, if, if they, if they start shooting behind you, you got to go forward and then a lot of times it's an ambush. So I think those are a little more harrowing, but the one that had to be was, was up there in the dark. Uh, like we went back and forth between Da Nang and Chu Lai. Chu Lai was a detachment. And uh, my boat officer made lieutenant and off the boat he goes and they split us up. And I got out another crew. He makes lieutenant, they split that up. So uh, they made me a staff engineman, which was pretty boring. And I'm down at Chu Lai and uh, one, of the, one of my fellow engineers came up and he said that his crew was going down to Catlow in the Delta. And I says, your problem? He says, I don't want to go. He says, I'll die down there. Well, the truth of the matter was he was in love with a Vietnamese girl who worked over in the Chalo. But the, uh, his boat officer knew me, and when I went down to, you know, to the hooch, and we said, we'd like to swap. He says, sure. So down to Catlow I went, and so we patrolled the, the three main rivers, the Cochin, the Hamlong, and the Mekong, and the Soy Rap. They were three and a half day patrols. I managed to get out with all of my parts intact, thanks to a boat officer that was pretty aggressive. He said, he said, I'm not going to wait for him to shoot at me here. And uh, I always laugh because he said, it's easier to get forgiveness than it is to get permission. <clears throat> so I returned from there in 1969 in the summer. I went aboard a destroyer on a Long Beach. <clears throat> 